Red lights all around. Icy roads and crashes caused an eight hour closure of Interstate 84 eastbound between Troutdale and Hood River on Tuesday, backing up hundreds of trucks before the road reopened at 1.30. The Multnomah County Sheriff's Office reports the driver of an SUV died this morning. Investigators say that driver was likely standing outside their car when a semi truck crashed into them, killing them. Later, another semi crashed into the scene. The sheriff's office says ice may have been a factor, something the Oregon Department of Transportation is warning drivers about. Anybody who's planning holiday travels over the coming holiday weekend needs to plan ahead. And that means uh, know where you're going, know what your travel route looks like, check the trip check cameras to know what your uh, destination looks like, and allow extra travel time. ODOT spokesperson Don Hamilton says salt trucks and de-icer and sanding trucks are ready for projected icy conditions on Thursday into Friday and the weekend. Everybody should be watching the forecast very, very carefully. If you can plan ahead and leave before the storm hits, that's always a very wise decision. On the Washington side of the gorge, crashes closed State Route 14 at different points Tuesday, something that may happen again this week slowing down for con the, the conditions. Uh, you can't expect to drive 55 in weather conditions like this. Washington Department of Transportation spokesperson Tamara Greenwell says the upcoming weather may be difficult to manage if temperatures are at or just below freezing. There's a very difficult uh, transition point where we are working to get a de-icer down, but we don't want that de-icer to be washed off by the rain that's coming uh, or traffic that's on the roadway. Um, but then there's a period when it starts to freeze. An incoming storm, she says, paired with a much anticipated holiday weekend will create difficult conditions for drivers. ODOT spokesperson Don Hamilton joked with me that the Columbia River Gorge gets everything from snow, wind, rain, ice, visibility issues, maybe everything except locusts, he said. But still, when it comes to the next couple of days, slowing down, taking extra time to get to your destination, checking those track of maps, having blankets, food just in case, all of those good recommendations if you're driving through this way on either side of the border. David? Absolutely. Evan Watson and Troutel. Thanks, Evan. Now is the time as we have been.